this jail's been a disaster since the day it opened. And, and it continues to be. We suffered, and the employees suffered by the construction of the jail. You know, it's a it's a maximum security type design jail that was never supposed to see over 1,200 inmates. We average about 2,200 inmates. We have a lot of, of cells with three inmates. In okay. And then we're very limited. And then when, you, when, you, when an inmate gets booked in, they go to classifications. And that's where they try to assign them appropriately throughout the jail. You've got every gang known to man that's trying to get to each other and hurt each other. You've got to try to separate them. And, and all these, and you've got witnesses, you know, it might be the same crime. And you've got you've got people involved in it. You've got people that's going to be witnesses. you got to keep separated. This agency does so much more than and and you first I mean they're good employees they they do their job they're professional and you you almost never have a complaint or a major incident with, with the rest of the agency it's it's an awesome responsibility to be the sheriff there's a lot of a huge amount of liability connected to it but I'm I'm just, I've been in law enforcement almost 47 years and I've been blessed with good health. I don't give up, I'm relentless, and, and I'm going to, once I become the official elected sheriff, I'm going to work every day to make huge changes.